Hello everybody, my name's Kindle, and we're going to continue with the Resident Evil series with number 2, the remake. I have not played as Claire, so that's what I'm going to do in this playthrough. I'm going to do it on standard, not hardcore, just because I want to get through these. Look man, I'm serious, okay? I saw this with my own eyes. Oh, I believe you, buddy, I believe you. <laughs> just tell us a story, tell us a story. Okay, well, it was last Friday night, I was walking home from the bar, and this woman started coming towards me. She was staggering, you know, so I, I figured she was drunk. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, tell us, be honest now, how many drinks did you have? No, man, I, I barely had a buzz on her. Oh, come on. Look, just listen, all right? She got closer, and I got a good look at her. You had to see her eyes, her nose, her whole face. It looked like it was rotting. Yeah. She looked like a corpse, like a walking corpse, man. <laughs> Sounds like my wife. I've never seen anything like it. I haven't been able to sleep since that night. All right, calm down, buddy. Calm down. Just, hey, you gotta stay strong, okay? Don't give in to fear out there, right? Yeah, well, you got that right. If you freeze up around these things, it'll sink to teeth and build them. Oh, come on. It's just getting good. All right, here we go. I'm gonna fix the audio real quick, though. Been a while since I've uh, played this. I played it on my uh, PlayStation 4, so it's a look a little bit different on uh, on PC graphics-wise. <laughs> bloody ground, all the fun stuff. Hello? Anybody here? Hello? And this one's a lot more cinematic, so I'm gonna kinda keep to that theme and cut myself out, which you've already seen. I didn't do that in the first one. Or maybe I did. I don't know. I haven't edited those yet. But just look at this, though. Like, holy cow. You can see all the particles of dust and all that. It's crazy, man. Alright, here we go. This is the important part, though. Are you okay? Wait here. I'll check it out. You should get a... Band-aid on that, dude. So I believe this one starts off basically right after the mansion stuff happened. Excuse me, is everything okay? Stay back, man. I got this.
Don't come any closer. And so it begins. Oh, whoops. Sorry, but I'm trying to see. Nah, I don't think I can get around this without wasting some Oh, maybe I can. Eh? Eh? Eh, there we go. <laughs> there we go. I think I'll still have to shoot him now. Just trying to do it without uh, using any ammo up. But I don't think that's possible, so. Let's see. Twice. No. Three times. There we go. It's not too bad. Oh, right. This will be weird because I've been using the um, controller for the last game and I'm finally using mouse and keyboard again, so that'll be nice. He's zombie. Another zombie. See, I want to know where those guys came from. They came from outside or what? Have some answers at the police station. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah, Leon Kennedy. You are? Claire. Claire Redfield. Live around here? No. I'm looking for my brother. He's a cop too. Well, it's a good thing we found each other. I don't know what to expect anymore. Attention all citizens, due to the citywide outbreak, you are advised to take shelter at the Raccoon City Police Station. Free food and medical supplies will be provided to everyone in need. Oh my god, this is so unreal. Police station's not much farther. They'll know something. Yeah, but what if we're the only ones? What if there's no survivors? No, there's survivors. It's a big city. There has to be. Looks like we're walking from here. Oh, 
Holy shit. There, get out. Get out now! Okay? Yeah, I'm all right. How about you? I can't stay here. It's not safe. Oh, shit. Go on ahead. I'll meet you at the station. And here we go. Man, this uh, remake is crazy. Gotta keep moving. I mean, I know I played it already, but like, this looks incredible. This is crazy. Oh, I think I went the wrong way. Nope. Oh. Oh. I don't remember if this is the same exact way that Chris went or Leon went. The police station. Almost there. I think it is. I think this is. Yeah, this is the same layout that he uh or. Same way that you get to the police station if you play Leon. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go. She's got the uh, revolver too, which is pretty cool. Because uh, I think Leon just had regular old pistol or whatever. So, I don't know. But let's check out the police station. This ought to be interesting playing as uh, Claire. Let's see what she does. Probably the same thing, most part. Bullets, yes, please. Yeah, you get to save without ribbons. Come on, Chris. Where are you? Oh, shit. They're inside, too. David, Marvin, you there? I found a way out. It's in here. Send reinforcements! East hallway! I should help this guy. Alright. Well, let's go help this guy real quick. I semi remember how to do this some of this in here, but not a whole lot. I remember the key thing. I remember this thing. So, I'm just gonna go ahead, go after this cop over yonder. Ooh, I'll take that though. Yes, please. Was it here? Oh wait, I need to look at the map. Maybe I can use the... Uh, uh, all right. And I love the map layout on this game. Like, you can actually see where everything is and how to get there and so on and so forth. It's really cool. So, anyway. Oh, yeah.
Man, this is so dark in here. That's right, you need another fuse. Have to find a fuse. And I remember most of these doors are locked, I think. And I don't remember half the jump scares in this game, so guaranteed I'm definitely Focus gonna <laughs> gonna get surprised. Oh, ah, that guy I think gets up. Or it could be like the remake of one where they get up. After a while? I don't remember. Unless there's nothing in here yet that I can use. Oh! Oh! It's got ammo. Convenient. Oops. I'll take that, and what is this? Huh. Nice. I don't remember much about this at all. But... Okay. Cool, moving onward. We have lots of ammo now. Which is super nice. <laughs> well, if nothing was alerted of my presence yet, they probably were now. Zombie? No, nope. help. Oh. I'll take that. Zombie? Nope, flooded toilet. Got it. Unless nothing happens to start with, I don't remember. I, th I want to say. These get up at some point, but not yet. Oh, oh my god. I think they give it time for you to be like, oh, it's probably safe, and then they... Open up! Yeah, Hurry! they don't keep it safe. Open up! Open this goddamn door! Okay, okay. Calm thyself. <laughs> and how do you know I'm even here? I'm here! Open the door! Officer's notebook. Oh yeah. So it just tells you basically how to get out. And you need these. And those little uh, pink circles, I guess you want to call them. That's the, uh, whatchamacallit, the little circles you put in next to the goddess statue thing. Anyway. Now's where it gets going. Yep. I remember now. I'm trying to see how they move around, because I don't remember and I don't want to waste ammo. Oh, yep. Come through the door, or windows. I forgot about that. Alright. <laughs> Hello. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh. I hope there's none behind me. Oh wow. Ah, crap. Oh, well. <laughs> Guess that works. 
Well, we've already started uh, within 15 minutes. I can't aim. Got it. Obviously, someone taught you well. Yeah, I know how to take care of myself. Come on. So nobody knows what caused this? There's a lot of theories. But all I know for sure is that this place is crawling with zombies. Yeah, you're telling me. Hey, hey, keep that on. Just in case. I'm not gonna be around long. Once I find Chris, we're out of here. You really Chris's sister? Yeah. Why? Did you find something? He's on vacation. Europe, I think. Left weeks ago. Vacation? That's... that's great news. Well, I've got more for you. Looks like there might be a way out through this secret passageway. Good. Hey. Hey, we should probably get you to a hospital. Oh, 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 forget about me. I can take care of myself. No. Don't be ridiculous. You're gonna need some help. Listen, Claire. Save yourself. So you can see your brother again. Now. You'll probably need this. No, I'm not taking that. You're gonna... Shh. And be careful. If you see one of those things, no matter who they were, you can't hesitate. Take them out if you can, or you run. Interesting. So that was a lot more different dialogue than when I played as Leon. That is interesting. So, another thing that's interesting. Obviously, Chris is not on vacation <laughs> in Europe. He went to that mansion. But it kind of seemed, and I, this might be stretching it, but it seemed like Claire maybe knows that that's not what that means. I don't know if that's true or not, but the way she responded to that seemed kind of like she was like, crap, I know what that means. A little bit. I could be wrong. I could totally be wrong. But yeah. Chris was uh, not on uh, vacation going through the, uh, the, uh, the the mansion, that is for sure. Oh, I wonder if I have to actually look at this and then it'll show up on the map. Ah, uh, yeah. Because, let's see. Yeah, I didn't look at the bottom one, so I need to look at them to make sure I know where that was weird where the uh what you would call it where the keys need to be used and i like how they kept that in the second game like i'm it well, actually they kept it through all the games i've played at least it's back in seven so four five and six are the ones i'm not so sure about excuse me. it was lion uh, leaf bird, right? Oops, lion leaf. Oh. Voila. Okay, so that's that. What is over here? Because I do not remember. I think it's another key thing or something. Oh, I can go in there. Let me check out this. Nothing this way. Well, let's see what's over here real quick. 
Okay, so you do need a key to go in here, though. It's another spade. What is this? Guide pamphlet. Welcome to Raccoon City. Did you know while we are the home of pharmaceutical giant Umbrella Corporation, yay. Raccoon City is a vibrant and dynamic city with a long, rich history of its own. And this guide will introduce you to just a few of the more unusual points of interest our city has to offer. Raccoon City Police Station, where I am. The building in the center of town wasn't always a police station. In fact, it used to be an art museum. Ah, that's right. I knew there was something funny about this. Uh, various features, like the unusual clock tower and the goddess statue in the main hall, remind, of the, remind us of a bygone era. Orphanage. Just a few blocks down from the police station is an orphanage founded and run by the Umbrella Corporation, with the help of generous donations from businesses and citizens alike. The building is known for its stained glass window, which attracts visitors from around the world. So I think this whole thing is kind of like a little, uh... It turns a museum into a police station. Into sort of a... Uh, whatever the word is for telling the future. This, this this word. Also, as I'm sure you've noticed, there is a butt ton of light coming in from this room. That's because it's super nice outside today, and I don't really care if it's crappy light. I'm enjoying it, so. Sorry. So I might as well put the lion thing in here. Put one in there. Okay. Oh. I guess it does it for me. So Elliot was right. Yeah, but we're not out of here yet. Oh yeah, I forgot. This is in the 90s. Like, this is 98 that this is happening. So all the computers and stuff are older. I totally forgot about that. I think that's another reason I like these games so much. I like games that go back in the past and aren't all present day stuff. Just seems more fun that way sometimes. Not all times, but sometimes. Uh, I don't think I need the herb at the moment. I don't need another spray. I only probably need one for now. I will definitely need them later, I'm sure. But if I remember correctly, it's not too bad to start off with. I feel like Claire has more ammo provided to her, too. As well, so that's something to keep in mind. Is this something? I thought this was something. Bloody ground. Also, the sound in this game. On point. My goodness, it is so good. Also, this game, a lot more bloody and gory than the first one, <laughs> and it just gets worse from there, I'm sure. <laughs> that? The clover, that's what those are called, I believe that's what those are called. Three-leaf clover. Ah, the windows. And you can board those up, I remember that. Oh. Can I not go in there? Oh, it's just a electronic panel or something. Man, I remember the first time I played this game, though. I was just doing this the whole time. <laughs> Hello. That's right, they can bust through pretty easily. Better for that now. Nope, oh, well. You, I'll stay away from There's a chain here. Map? Yeah! Nice. So yeah, like, already? Super big, but 
The thing with one, obviously, was the door thing, where it literally had a little uh, cutscene for every single time you went into a door. Oh my word, I'm glad this one does not have that. And I, that they did not keep up with that uh, idea. Because, <laughs> man, that sucked. Yep, I remember there being something here. Just ammo? Okay. Okay, she holds a lot of ammo. I think it only goes to like 30 something and then you have to have another like ammo box or something you can carry. I believe. That's locked. I think most of these are locked for now. Okay, this one's not, but I need the combination and I need the little keypads as well. I need those two missing keypads to open stuff up. So what am I missing? Two and three? So, two, three, six I can open, and I think nine I can open? I'll double check, and then I need a, a little uh, key card or whatever for that one. So I can't open any of these because they're too big. What's up, dude? Uh, I guess I'll take out... I'll take you both out, because I don't want to have to come back these guys. Oh, that's the difference. She's got a more powerful weapon, but you got to reload a lot more. Oh, hello. Didn't think he was going to come after me that fast. Should remember that. What the hell is up with you? I think they have to get knocked down twice and then they're they're good. I think. I don't know if they start bleeding on the ground like they did. <laughs> uh those are the best. Anyway, I don't think they do the whole oh I missed this. Bleeding on the ground thing. Storage locker terminal memo. It appears that the key bed to the locker's, ter locker's terminal is missing a few keys. I suggest the person responsible for this mess find some spare keys and fix this right now. You know who you are, bastard. Who else F, with it, F it up this badly? Oh, I wonder who it is. 109 and 106, I think. 106. Yeah. It's a battery. What is that? I'm not sure what that is. I don't remember. Yeah, I can't do anything with threes and twos for the time being. It's film! That's right, I remember. Because that'll help me along the way. And I can actually probably use that pretty soon too, in fact. Oh, I guess I just stopped wiggling now. Decided to give up the twerking life. So, I do know I can go in the office, right? Yeah. So, yeah, I'll, yeah, I'll go ahead and go in here and get the stuff. What is this? Gunpowder. Right, because you can make stuff. Uses of gunpowder. Handgun ammo is two gunpowder. Acid rounds is gunpowder plus high-grade gunpowder. Submachine gun ammo is high-grade gunpowder. There's not a lot of ammo left around the station, so make good use of any gunpowder you find. Different guns require different ammo, so pay attention when you're combining things or you won't get what you need. This is true. I do remember the first time I played this, I messed that up a couple times. And I just had an excess of a bunch of different stuff that I didn't need. You get back up. I remember that. It's so another safe. Combinations, I think, don't pop up for a while. And the code to this is their first name or last name? I can't remember. Okay. Rookie's first assignment. This is for Leon, Leon S. Kennedy. We're putting you on a very special case for your first assignment. Your mission is to unlock your desk. The key to your success is in the initials of our first names. Okay, input the letters in order of our desks. There are two locks, one on each side of your desk. Make sure you get them both. Basically, your first task is to remember your fellow officer's name, but names, but you figured that much out, right? 
Good luck, Leon. By the way, it might take a little work to get Scott to give you a straight answer. So Scott to give you a straight answer. Scott is either I wonder if that's his last name. Lieutenant Brana? I don't know. Scrawled in the corner between drops of blood. Be glad you're not hero. Well that's sad, because like that seemed like a fun group. Like, come on, can you imagine on your first day of whatever job you do that that's the first thing you have to do is like, hey, figure out this uh combination code so you can remember our names. <laughs> That'd be super cool. Okay, so there is Marvin. That's the guy up front, Rita. And this guy. You asshole. Oh, hell. <laughs> the thing I like about Claire is how she's just <laughs> really annoyed at it. Oh. I think that's funny. It just gives it a little sense of humor that it wasn't there. Is up with you? <laughs> and uh, I think that was the only thing that Chris, or not Chris, that uh, Leon didn't have as much of. So Marvin, Rita, uh, and George. MRJ. Who is this guy? Is he crawling on the ground or something? Oh, yes. So, MRJ. M. R. J. G, not J. Oh. Oh, I had to, <laughs> had to press confirm. Okay, David. Operation report September 28th. 2.30 a.m. It's down to just me and three others. No weapons, no ammo, and too many skirmishers have drained us mentally and physically. Skirmishes, sorry. We're not going to make it. Officer Phillips once suggested we escape through the sewers. Apparently there's a secret tunnel under this place left over from its museum days. I brushed her ID off before, but now it's not sounding all that bad. Yeah, there's no proof there's even a tunnel or that the sewers aren't infested with zombies. But I don't want to sit here and wait to die either. It's a long shot, but I'm going to try to find out what I can about the tunnel. Elliot Edward. Sad. Okay, David D. Elliot E. Oh. Oh. There we go. There we go. In. So what? D E N? Right? D E N, yeah. What's the Scott thing about? I don't know. Oh, it's this. Is it this way? Yeah, D E N. Ned. There we go. It's just backwards. I forget why. Speed loader? Ah, yeah, upgrade it. Yeah, I forgot about that. There's Leon's only nice thing preserved here. Yeah, the shame. Is this locked? This is locked. Another spade key. Okay. Am I going there? Or is that from the other side? I think that's from the other side. Still not dead. Um. You're back up too? Oh my word. Okay, well I'm gonna leave here because I think it's all I need at the moment. And I'm gonna go over here. What's up, dude? I don't think... Is that barred? I don't remember if they can get through there or not. Might be able to. Grab that. I'll grab that. Um, I'm not gonna use it on that one though, because I don't think I need it. Oh, I'll turn this light. Medicinal benefits of herbs. Humans have used herbs to treat sicknesses, sickness and disease since the dawn of time. In this book, we will explore three such herbs native to the Arclay Mountains. Probably not pronounced right. Green herbs have the ability to heal basic injuries, while blue herbs have long been used to treat poisoning. As for red herbs, they while they are visually visually appealing, they offer no medicinal benefits. 
or so it was thought until recently. It is well known that combining herbs together produces blends that heighten the herbs' effects, but it has but it has been discovered that red herbs can play a big role in mixed properly. According to one doctor of Asian medicine, mixing blue and red herbs together produces a blend that will strengthen one's constitution. Hmm. Truly, we have only just begun to realize the full potential of these herbs and their ability to heal the human body. Further research is sure to yield even more fascinating results. Cool. So here is where I can use this. And get this for commemorative photo. Bring the gunpowder, just in case. Oh yeah, I can use that. That is a lot nicer too, that you can just press the space bar and then use that. Yeah, I don't... Can he go? Okay, yeah, he can go through there. Yep. Okay, pretty sure you get up. But you're holding something. Bring it. Yes, thank you. Okay, so I should be on the lookout for a fuse, at least. That's the one thing I know I need at the moment. And the spade key. And someone comes out of this locker, and it freaked the crap out of me the first time I played this. Yeah. And there's a lock. What if I just use that? B-E-K. Nope. Flame rounds. So you don't really need those yet. I'll grab them. Okay, portable safe. Oh yeah, these are interesting. You gotta use this weird combo. Portable safe instructions. Press a button to light up its corresponding lamp. Light all of them to open the safe. The buttons must be pressed in a certain order. Pressing a single button out of order will cause all the lights to go out and you'll need to start the sequence over again. So, is that a quick examining item? Yeah, 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 all right. Oops, nope. nope. It's kind of an accident, but there we go. What a unsafe safe. <laughs> ah, okay, so I can I can use that now. Cool. And I can't go that way because that'll blow my face away. So, let's go back this way. Let's see what's over here. Nothing. Oh, something. Hello. Red. Okay, cool. Well, let's just store all this junk real quick and then I'll go upstairs to the third floor. Then. Oh. Fuck! Same. And then we'll come back down to safe. Oh, that's right. Your knives can get used up. I think. Is it? There we go. So, oh, two. Gives me film. Oh no, gunpowder gives me gunpowder. I'm gonna go ahead and combine this. This guy, find this, this guy. I'm not even sure what that's used for. I think that's like a... Actually, I don't know. I don't remember. Because I don't remember using it much. But I'll grab some. Where were you? I know I saw you there a second ago. So, I don't remember... What is here? More ammo. Sweet. Okay, you can carry a lot of ammo, apparently. I want to say there's another locker here that has a lock. Yep. Let's see if it just works. No. Okay. Ah! Spade key? Yeah. Nice. Well, that'll definitely help me get around a lot. So here. Ooh. I think this might be a tricky part. Yep. What was that? Yep. That's when they introduce those fun things. 
Also, apologies if it is extremely laggy for you guys. I have not... Why? I'm not sure why it wants me to view my files. Film? Nope, got the powder. It's definitely laggy on my side just because I'm using a TV monitor and <laughs> the frame rate is like kinda 60 frames, 60 hertz. Kinda, but not really. To any survivors. Consider this a gift for anyone still unfortunate enough to be alive. Keep your eyes peeled for those creepy Fs that look like they were skinned alive. Lickers, we call them. They're blind as bats, but their hearing more than makes up for that. So long as you don't run around like a total idiot, guns ablaze, and you should be able to slip right by them, probably. Either way, make like it my grandma and creep around as slow as possible around them, yeah? Anyway, not that I want to go, but duty calls, and I've got a friend to avenge. I did not know that about the walk. So I can just move like that. <laughs> he drops one ceiling, for sure. If I remember correctly, maybe not yet, but he will. And another thing that I'm not going to tell you guys about just yet, well I might have already, but uh, I would definitely want to find as many things now as I can and open up as many rooms as I can right now before something else happens. Because that'll make it a lot more difficult. Some guys scribblings. Damn those corporate assholes. They cut me off after all I've done for them. But, it's, but if that's how it's going to be, so be it. I'm going to have a little fun of my own as the world goes to crap. I boarded all those filthy pigs up in a steel pin and set some C4. All I gotta do is detonate it and it's sayonara, suckers. But it's no fun if it's over too soon, so maybe I'll give what one raving loon something to really squeal about. Yeah, maybe I'll give him a little toy and tell him, kill the next guy to you and I'll spare the others. I wonder what he'll do. You yell about justice and pride, but how many times did you go against me, your own superior? Yeah, you're such a good cop. So good you had to die. Man, this is fun. I need some music for this. Yeah, hip pouch, nice. So I can get that as soon as I get the other key thing. So that's where the other medallion is. One of the other ones, anyway. Gonna flop to the floor yet? There we go. No? Come on, you're barely hanging on. I have to go past him, I bet. Ah, yes. Uh, what is there to find in here? Oh, the floor drops out somewhere. I'm probably going to find that out later than I'd hope to. I think it's the middle one that drops away. Claire, oh. it's Marvin. How fast can you get back here? Why, what's that? I've got something to show you. It's important. All right, I'm on my way. Well... Well, I guess I'm going down. So I'm just gonna... See how many of these guys there are. There's quite a few. Oh! It's right here. Upper floors. Cool. Well, that's convenient. I totally forgot that was that easy. Uh, this is the unicorn, right? Mm. Unicorn is two fishes, scorpion, and something. Two fish, scorpion. That thing? Whatever that thing is. Oh, do I have room? Oh, I do, because I got the extra thing. So, hello. So, oh, there's more in here. Where? 
gunpowder. Yeah, I'll take gunpowder and I'll combine it with this, in fact. Boom. Yep, not ex cool. Aw, oh, 60. We're close to 60. Ah, oh, loop around, loop around. Get stuck in here. Oh, never mind. Oh, crap. Man, Jesus smacked that guy. Okay, so that's no bueno. What's this? Oh, red book. I need this to put in that guy's hand, which is why I had the photo. Same to you. Oh, that's bad. I'm not gonna use my health until I get to low. Oh. Waste it. Okay, I should take these guys out though. Not good. Okay, which way are you gonna come from? <laughs> They're pretty dumb. I will say that. And I am too for missing. Oh, great. She gets up. Oof. Well, I got enough ammo, that's for sure. Oh, that was bad. No. Okay, second time down. They have not been down, it's just her, so they'll get back up. Where are you going, bud? There we go. So, let's... Oh, right, I need the thingy. I think there's something hidden behind here, though. Oops. If I remember correctly. Not that one, maybe it's this one. Yeah. Even more handgun ammo. Ham ham gun? Handgun ammo. Okay, so I need the crank. I'll go ahead and move these though. To make it easier. And I will need to move that up so I can move it to the right. Oh, hello. Hey, hey, knife. Nice. Okay, this is a spade key so I can actually use that. Where does that lead me? Ah, that leads me out here. So I'll go ahead and use that. Just so I have an easy way to get back. So that's there. Let's check upstairs. Not gonna walk through there. Oh! Well, I remembered it incorrectly. You can definitely walk through there, but, or well, maybe you can't. You can't walk through that area. Which is why you need that in the first place, which makes sense. Which kind of sucks because you could easily jump, but, you know, it's whatever. Where can I use this key? I can use the key over there. Use the key down here to the office so I can just open that area up, if anything. Yeah, so okay, I'll just go open the office up. Oh, Marvin had something he wanted to say too, so I'm gonna see what he has to say first. There you are! Come here! What is it? Take a look. Oh my god, he made it! You know him? Yeah! It's Leon! Uh... Kennedy, I think? Oh, uh, the rookie. Thought he looked familiar. You can make it to that courtyard. The second floor, east side. Okay. Thanks, Marvin. I'm on it. Mm. Poor Marvin. Mm. Let's use this real quick. So that's just a little shortcut now. Place this bad boy over here. Boom. Two out of three already. We're like making some super duper good progress right here. Alright, here we go. The, for spade key, I feel like I'm going to use that a lot. Organize items, discarding items, 
Okay, so that is the last thing. That. Yes. It's an art room. Yeah, and this is why I need the book. What is this? Oh, is this security? Weapons locker key card. Heck yeah. Take that. Art article, the red stone, the ruby that captivated Edward the Black Prince, the pearl that the Queen of the Nile milked dry, the diamond that led a queen to the guillotine. There is no end to the number of tales related to the appeal of jewels. This mysterious red stone is simply the latest to sparkle among them. Like those other jewels, this one's origin is unknown. It's said that one... It, uh, it's said that it once adorned a noblewoman's jeweled box and was even dedicated to a wise king. This fall, this stone, this fall, this stone, that's long been shrouded in legend, will be a display during auction. There are sure to be many eager, eager enthusiasts there. But, dear reader, one would do well to approach with care, for devilry, devil, devilry, lives in beauty's shadow. This jewel has turned no, uh, caring nobles who love their subjects into despots, despots, whatever, more terrible than. Caligula, and we have the tales to prove it. Seriously, it's precious. It's precisely. Seriously, it's precisely because these jewels are bathed in blood that their luster stirs something in the hearts of people everywhere. Lovely. Okay. Got his arm here too. The left arm. Well, let's plop that bad boy in there. Let's plop this bad boy in there. Oh, no, no, no. oh, 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 Something! Oh, whoops! I am not doing it right. Salmon! Uh, oh, let me space. Find something. Got it. Right, jewel. Do I examine this? I don't remember. I don't think so. Yeah, I just have a red jewel now. Cool. Anything else in this room? Nope. Okay, moving onward. Here we go! Right, this guy. Ah, yes, I need a crank. I remember that now. First things first, though, I'm gonna go dump some of this stuff, and I'm going to use that weapons locker uh, keycard real quick. So I will do that, and then I'll be right back over there. Yeah, there we go. I see, now I see what that was used for. This grenade launches this grenade launcher is capable of firing flame and acid rounds. Ooh, and it only takes one little spot. Alright, here we go. Right, I remember this part. I keep that herb right there. Yeah, I can go this way. And there's a big old helicopter right there. Interesting how it didn't catch fire or anything. I think it might later. meeting like this. Are you all right? Police chopper, it just came out of nowhere. Yeah, I'm fine. I take it you don't have the key. No, I don't. It's good to see your face, though. How are you holding up? I am hanging in there. Hell of a night, huh? Yeah, 
You find your brother? I did actually. He's. <laughs> Just me think he can't get any worse. Leon, you should get going. Don't worry about me. Just get yourself to safety. No, Leon, seriously, they're getting through the fence. Please, just go. We're gonna make it. Both of us. Well, let's hope so. Ooh, do Marvin? I get the bolt cover cutters? Haha, <laughs> I do. Sorry to... Okay. We've got zombies everywhere. Marvin? Marvin, are you there? Oh. Marvin? I think I remember this part. It sucks. Let's see. Let's fill up our whole inventory. Because <laughs> why not? Okay, so I can use these now. That's super nice. I think they use those in 7, too. Where am I? Oh, I'm back here. There's somewhere that was blocked by chains. I thought. I can't remember. I guess I'll have to just find out. Oh, it was right there. Oh, did I not look at it? I don't think I looked at it. Okay, well, since I'm here... Oops, sounds like someone's waking up or something. Yep. Okay, uh, let's see what I can find in here. Some herb. Actually, I can't pick up anything, can I? No, I can't. Uh... I'll just head back to the main area real quick. Ah, I'll have to find that fuse. Oh! Can I not go back? I don't have any room for anything else. Can I drop stuff? Guess I'll find out. Oh. Ooh, that's open now. Is there anything else in here? I think so. Okay, so... Doesn't look like I can go back to the main area. Yes. Oh! That was just awful. Ah, oh, there's the fuse, but I don't have a place to store my crap. Oh, and there's the valve. And there's film? Gunpowder. Crap, can I drop anything? Oh, I can just put a... Okay, I'll put the wooden board up somewhere. This is probably not a horrible place to put it anyway. Um, let's just put it right here. Okay. What's he got? He's got ammo. Buying it. Uh, fuse, so we can get back. No, not grenade. Uh, I don't want that. I thought that was fuse. Cancel. Just keep there. Okay. Um. Crap. Oh. They're all over the place. No, oh, that grenade might be a good idea at this moment. I guess the valve is the only way I can get back. Let's see real quick. So the valve goes here. Which goes there. Ugh. That's the only place I can get to, but I can't get there without fuse, so I guess I have to get the valve at the moment? Oh wait, what's that? Is that the fuse? That might be the fuse. There's so much stuff in here. There's so many zombies in here. Where was it? I just saw it. Oh. Let's race to it again. So that's the grenade. It's a fuse in here. Oh, I see where it is. Ah, there it is. Dang it. Wasted my knife on that one. 
sad. Okay. Well, at least I can put some junk up. Okay, now there's a butt ton of stuff to pick up, so I want to pick up this for sure. Uh, probably just that for now. Maybe a flash glow. Oh, okay, this is this. Is, I deserve that for being dumb and careless. So I'll 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 say that one's on me. Okay, okay. Maybe I should use this bad boy. See what happens. Okay, that guy I don't think is getting up again. Oh, oh yeah, there's a room that opened up over here. It's like a storage room, I think. Yeah. Too bad I can't use the big flashlight. Demo. Yeah, it's perfect. I will take this because I think I should put another one in here. Okay. Ah. Let's see your head blow up. I can do this. Sure can. Aw, oh, sad. I was hoping his head was going to pop like it did in the first game. Oh, I actually want to see how the smoke bomb works. Her flashbang? Oh, that didn't work. Oh! Check those corners, just like Call of Duty. Check those corners! Does it go here? No, it doesn't go here. Oh, the shower. Oh, 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 oh. I go to the opposite building. Or not building, opposite side of the building. I remember now. Ooh. Oh, oh, hello. It's sneaky. Sneaky enough, though. It's still there. Here we go. We can use this bad boy. Alright, so we need something for the C4. We need something. For both those levers. I don't know if it's the same thing. I don't think so. I think it's two separate things. And. Some other stuff, maybe? Oh, okay. <laughs> Zombie in here? No. Gunpowder, don't need that. Nothing. That's fine. Ah, yeah. See that up there? That is a liquor. Oof. So, be quiet and also pack a punch. So, maybe if I do this. Badness. It's very, it's lots of badness. You can't see, so. Interesting. Yeah, I did not do that last time, so that makes a lot more sense to be quiet like that. That's all I have to say. Okay, I have. Plenty of ammo when I need it. Because I will definitely need it. So there. Locked. Oh. Yeah. Okay, so I have to find that USB stick to do something about that. Oh yeah. There we go. Remember if you destroy those, it gives you something. 
There's something in here, though, that I'm supposed to use, I think. Right? Oh, 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 I didn't see this door wide open. Battery. I need a battery for... Don't remember. Maybe this will tell me. Internal memo. Submit September 22nd, 1998. Office supply internal relocation notice. Heat resistant three number combination safe. Moved from stars office 2F to west office 1F. Okay. Combo is left 9, right 15, left 17. So I need to get that bad boy. So this is west office 1F. So first floor, oops, west office, so this area, so I can get that. So I want to grab that bad boy, but first, I should heal up. First, first. Ooh. Not good. Floor? Oh, they crawl through the vents. So inching my way. <laughs> Having a little problem there, bud. Come on, you want to hop on the ceiling? I don't think I can get around this guy. So maybe I should go back in here for a second. There we go, maybe that'll work. Okay, perfect. So if I just sneak my way this way, it should be fine. Man, this would have saved me a lot of issues when I first played this game because my goodness I just died over and over and over again so that that is a bolt lock need like an RF something or other reader oh no wait is this the same place Ah, I see. I see, I see. Okay. Oh! Dang it! Okay, this room's annoying me. So you know what you get? That's what you get. There. So, that won't be a problem anymore. Okay! Uh... Yeah, so... What's it? Left 9, right 15, so 9, 15, 7. So left, when I go left, it's like this. Which makes sense because you're turning left. So 9, 15, 7, 7. There we go. Hey, hey! Nice! Still don't know what to do with the red jewel or the battery. Oh, what's that? I didn't see that before. Record of events. September 25th, we're turning the station into a temporary shelter due to the massive sudden outbreak. All police personnel have been instructed to make the safety of the citizens their top priority as we try to accommodate as many of them as possible. September 25th. One of these refugees attacked us in the middle of the night, resulting in the death of one officer and inju injuring three others. The person in question was quickly restrained. We believe this was a simply was simply a case of someone snapping under intense stress. Hmm. September 26th. A mob attacked the station today, resulting in a number of casualties. A few survivors were able to make it safely behind their emergency sh shutters, but surrounded as we, w we are, it'll be hard for any of us to escape this place. We're not sure we can fix any of our comm equipment, so we remain cut off from the outside world. September 27th. 
There was another clash on the west side of the station around 1 p.m. Twelve people died, and there are, well, there's only a handful of survivors left. Everything is falling into disarray in here. David Ford. I missed that last time I was in here. Okay, bolt cutters. That might be the last time I need the bolt cutters. Is this what I need the battery for? Yeah, it is, and this is to blow the C4. Nice. Locker room, CAP. Locker room. Okay, so the locker room is the one upstairs, which is funny because one of them actually did have CAP on it, so that's interesting. Oh, there's a here. I'll... I'll take that. What is my health like right now? It's caution, so I'll use this. Discard the bolt cutters. Eh, shoot this guy. As I can, and unlock this door. Or let's combine this guy. Whoops, no, I need to examine it, I think. And then I can put the battery in there. Yeah, okay, so I see that, so now I can combine. There we go. So now I have the detonator cap, right? Yeah, that's the one it was talking about. Yeah, more boom boom ammo. Okay. Got ten seconds, so am I. Is that in here? What the heck was that? Ooh, that's a lot. Not sure what that deal is all about. Anything over here? No? Alright, it's got the company. Oh, he's crawling. It sounded fast, what the heck? Okay. Where is officer's notebook? There. Oops. It's person arrow snake. Ooh, person. Ooh. That looks like a snake. There we go. Guessed that one pretty well. Okay. Cool. Already on our way to going uh downtown. Oh, I knew I heard one of those. I don't know that thing's dead. I knew I heard something though. No, 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 no. Oh. Whew. Let's just run way the heck over this way. I knew I heard something. I knew I wasn't crazy. Oh. Oh, okay. Is something gonna happen? Guess not. Alright, here we go. Like it leads underground. Good. We can get out of this hellhole. Hey, Marvin! Guess what? I think I found the way out. Marvin, come on. Let's get you out of here. Let's go. <laughs> Are you okay? Oh, no. I. Just go. Save yourself. Come on. Bad. We gotta get you to hospital. Please, now. Claire. We 
both know how this is going to end. Get out of the city. We can't just leave you here. Claire, please, go. Do this for me. Okay. Okay, Marvin. Thank you. Poor Marvin. That sucks. Got the big boy booms. Is that the mansion? I think that's the mansion. That's cool. Huh. From the first game. I do think that is what that is. Okay. Well, I have been running out of time. We're not running out of time. I have officially run out of time. I've been playing this for quite a while now. So I'm going to save it here. And we're going to continue going down the elevator into whatever is down below. I don't remember. The underground facility, that's what we're going to go to next, so... I hope you enjoyed Resident Evil 2 so far. I'm excited to get this one going and uh, on my way because I've kind of already breezed through this pretty fast so far, but that's just because I kind of know where everything's at and I sort of know what to expect. Obviously, I need to slow down a little bit, otherwise zombies are going to just annihilate me entirely. So I will continue this one very soon, and you won't have to wait too long for these to come out because I'm doing these like back-to-back, -back, so... Peace out, hang loose, rock on, God bless, and I will see you next time.